Hi everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hi and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you my mug collection. Lauren, why are you suddenly American? Serious. Hi everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm doing the video that you have all asked me to do for the past year, my mug collection. It was actually really hard to pick the first mug of the video, but I decided to go with the mug that has my business logo on and oh, I'm so vain. It actually has myself on it. I wish I knew where the mug obsession started. I'm sure I have Primark to blame for the mug starting obsession. Most of my mugs that I'm going to show you today, they're from the same places really. So we've got um, Disney Store. They're the best mugs without a doubt. Primark. Um... Ooh, Truffle Shuffle, a couple of them. Some of them have been made by customers and friends and family because everybody knows and supports my obsession. Yay, thank you guys, keeping it going. And um, Harry Potter Studios as well. Some of my best mugs are from the Harry Potter Studios. Most of them are Disney and Harry Potter, but there are some movie ones in there. Some of them I do use, some of them I'm like, hmm, should we not break this one? Do you know, touch wood, I haven't broken any mugs yet. Yay! Everybody cheers because Lauren breaks everything. I'm going to stop talking because you could probably like, you know, Lauren, we didn't want to see you, we wanted to see your mugs. And I understand, guys, they're my pride and joy too, so I understand that they need to be the star of the show. So, sit back, grab your own cuppa. Probably won't be as good as my collection. Uh, the amount of people I've had starting collections because of me, I am sorry. They are not cheap. <laughs> so, grab a cuppa and come inside my cupboard. That's like MTV, welcome to my crib. Welcome to my mug cupboard. <laughs> I need um, I need a dramatic theme tune. Uh, uh, first one to come to my head. Dun 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 La 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 la, why am I singing Jurassic Park? Dramatic theme tune number two is gonna be Dun 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 There is four more down here. Have you guessed the theme tune yet? If you have, we can be friends. Of course, it's Harry Potter. I'm going to stop singing theme tunes now. I'm actually going to show you the mugs. Now, these are part of a collection from Disney. We have Ariel, Belle and Sleeping Beauty. I got all three of these for my birthday. I was very lucky. I didn't actually get two of those, but I swapped it for the Ariel one. And we've got the, this is one of my favorite mugs. We have the Lion King London musical tour. If you've never seen this musical, you are so missing out. It's genuinely the best thing ever. Um, up is obviously my favorite. Sorry about the clattering. There's gonna be a lot of that. Um, oh yeah, the house is on the other side. This is the hardest thing to film ever. <laughs> we have, oh, I've got two of these actually. So I like to collect mugs when I go places. So then it's like a, a reminder. I'm not a magnet or a pin badge kind of gal. I'm a mug kind of gal. So we've got the Disneyland Paris one, which was the, I don't, was this the 25th anniversary? I'm not sure. Oh, this one was. I have this one as well. Matches it. 25th anniversary, so I'll always remember that I went then. I've also got two of these ones as well. This is the Mickey Mouse one. I love it so much. And then to match, I have the Lady in the Tramp one. How gorgeous are they? The other tall one is this one. Obviously you all know I'm not a huge fan of Frozen, but I thought this mug was absolutely gorgeous. Elsa and Anna on it. I'm going to show you my favourite mug. I don't know why it's my favourite. I just think it's absolutely beautiful. So it's the, um, oh, I think it says it on the other side. 80th anniversary of Pinocchio. Obviously, I got this from, I think every single one of these are from the Disney store. These two are from Paris, but still Disney. Every single one's from the Disney store, including this one. How beautiful is it? And I love Jiminy Cricket. I think he's so go gorgeous, like such a gorgeous Disney character. Obviously Disney store. And then that was from the musical. As soon as lockdown's over, I'm gonna go to loads of musicals. I'm gonna make sure I get a mug from every single musical that I go to. Okay, my second favorite mug coming up and I never put this upside down because it's Pizza Planet. 
and it's orky. Trash, 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 trash. I did accidentally break him, um, but he likes to sit up there anyway. And that that's probably my, those two are equally my favorites, I think. I love this one, my Aladdin one. Free to dream. Anyone that knows me knows that the live action Aladdin is literally one of my favorite films in the whole entire world. Still trying to get my boyfriend to watch it and actually enjoy it. Cause I keep telling him how incredible Will Smith is. Even though obviously Robin Williams will always be the genie. So that mug is so cute and that looks like the lamp as well. Oh, this one's beautiful, but I never drink out of it. You can probably tell why it's so difficult to drink out of. And it's all of her books, Looking for Adventure and the Mirrors there. That has to go at the front because it's just so beautiful. Look how amazing that is. They've actually got one on the Disney uh, store website right now. And it's very similar to that, but it's a lantern and it's got Pascal on the edge. But I'm like, it's 18 pounds. Do I need it? Yes, I do. So those two like to sit together. I always put chip inside. I think everyone's got a chip mug. So adorable. And then this is a new one um, because I've got an obsession with Mickey Mouse because obviously none of this would be possible without Mickey. It all started with a mouse. This one comes with one of the, the brooms, the sweeping brooms from Fantasia. So beautiful. So that's the first shelf. Though I, those ones I would say are probably my favourite mugs, apart from obviously the Harry Potter one. I did just say I had favourite mugs and that the bottom shelf was my favourite. I'd like to take this opportunity to take that back because I feel like I've hurt their feelings. Um, and I lied. I, they're all my favourites because now I've just cleared the back, sh the top. The sh now I've cleared the... <laughs> Shall I edit this bit out? <laughs> Now I've cleared the second shelf, I'm like, oh, I am really sorry, because guess who's on the second shelf? Wally. So, yeah, I take that back. I don't have favourites. They're all my children. I love you all so much. Oh, this one I obviously got from the Disney store. I love it. Because when the live act, I think that was when the live action came out. Sorry about my dirty cupboard. I will clean that at some point. Probably never. Um, when the live action came out, I was obsessed with all the merchandise because if anybody knows me, you'll know Lion King is probably my favourite Disney movie of all time. This one I got from Dubai. Just because, probably again, it was cheap, but I love the genie. This is my Halloween mug. Okay, this is so hard to film this. I'm going to show you this because this is genuinely one of my favourite ones. So we have the Evil Queen. How do people film these YouTube videos? Ursula and Maleficent. Don't ruin my morning. Oh, where else is good for mugs? Oh my goodness, like I completely forgot to tell you. Asda. This one's from Asda. It's adorable. Then we've got the Dory one. I think this was from Amazon, actually. And then, oh, Tom and Jerry. I think I got that from Warner Brothers World in Abu Dhabi. Abu Dhabi, because I always grew up on, on Tom and Jerry. So I love it, it's so cool. This is such a cool mug. Can't remember where I got this from, but honestly, I would have this mug as a cookie jar. It's so cool, Mr. Potato Head. What you looking at, you hockey puck? But let's put you there. Uh, next one, we, I have so many genies. <laughs> I love him. Oh, got these both for my birthday. Can I just tell you that? Um, because I did all the free quizzes on my page, um, I got sent loads of mugs. I got, I actually got, ended up getting three Wallies. So I had to like, you know, I, sw I think I swapped one of them, but gave one of them to a friend. So I have Wally and, is it Eve or Eva? Eva. Brand new mug I got at the same time as the Fantasia one. Flynn Rider, the wanted poster, and on the back is the Snuggly Duckling from Tangled. That's really cool. I think that's really cheap on the Disney store at the moment as well. I like to stand him up. Um, now, everybody knows my favourite Pixar, apart from Toy Story, is Just Keep Swimming, Just Keep Swimming, Escape. Finding Nemo. I can quote the entire movie, word for word, P. Sherman 42, Wallaby Way, Sydney. I remember it again! <laughs> Yes, I can also speak to whales, just like Dory. So I have Nemo and Dory. I like to face these guys out like this, together. 
Lucky Finn. My customer got me this one. I think this was on Amazon because it came with an Amazon note. Lovely old Dumbo. We have Billy Goat and Gruff from Toy Story 3, 4, and 1 and 2. Sorry. There we go. So now they're all facing. Can you see? They're facing the same way. It looks adorable. But now you see all the ones at the back are getting abandoned. Right. You can get this anywhere. She doesn't really fit in this cupboard. She would need her own. She would need to be with the superheroes. And on the back it says, love stinks. So for me. So this is Harley Quinn. She's pretty cool. One of my favorite mugs. I think you can get these from like any um, like merchandise -y place. You know, like movie merchandise. Like Truffle Shuffle probably. Gizmo! I have an issue with getting this mug wet. If you know, you know. That is the, the two favorite shelves. Now, I've just done it again. I've said they're my favorites, but then we're gonna get to shelf three with all the Harry Potter mugs. And I'm gonna have to apologize to them because everybody knows if I could choose to go to Disney or Hogwarts for the rest of my life, it would always be Hogwarts. It's my favorite place in the world. I'd like to take this opportunity to apologize to you all. I really didn't mean it that I said I had favorites. I love you all individually equally. You are all very special to me and you are all my children. You saw that on camera, they're not gonna be mad at me and go break on me or anything like that because they are all my favorites. <laughs> love y'all. Why do I only just realize I have two Nemos? I love finding Nemo. My favorite part is probably when she's reading and she's like, escape. It's really funny because it's spelled just like the word escape. You can read. I can read. <laughs> I have another, another Finding Nemo one. This time it's Dory. I think Dory is my favorite um, Disney character. She's just Ellen DeGeneres. She's just smashed it. She's incredible. She even got her own movie, didn't you, honey? And it's like, just keep swimming, just keep swimming. And the fact she can speak to whales and then you find out she can actually speak to whales like she didn't make it up. Now, because I keep watching Americans on YouTube, Every so often I'll be like, hi, I'm American. So if I slip in and out of American, it's because I think I was meant to be American. Like I feel like I should have been, I was, I was born in the wrong country, you know? This is my dad's mug. He doesn't let this drop. Basically I got him a mug from, I got him a mug from my holiday and it was his birthday present. And he said, you've got me as a, a mug as my birthday present. And I was like, dad, do you know how much I, I would die to have mugs for my birthday, you know? American again. So that's my dad's mug. Happy birthday, dad. <laughs> oh, so I went to Abu Dhabi. They have a Warner Brothers world. They've got Looney Tunes, Flintstones, but like all the staff dressed up as Flintstones and stuff. I felt like I was actually in the set of Flintstones. Scooby-Doo, um, all the superheroes. Like I went to Gotham City, which was incredible. So like I told you before, I get mugs like as souvenirs. Another Disney one, this is brand new. Um, the 101 Dalmatians when they're watching canine crunchies can be eaten, canine crunchies, that one. Love it. Um, Asda. I just thought that was just adorable. Uh, Winnie the Pooh. Oh, ham. I love it. I do feel like I need more Harry Potter mugs. Um, we are lacking in that department, but I will show you which ones I do have and they are awesome. So this one first, if you don't get my Harry Potter references, then there's something seriously wrong with you. I got about seven of these for my birthday because I like to quote Harry Potter a lot. <laughs> 12 years I waited in Azkaban. Just like that, there's no such thing as magic. My favorite Harry Potter quote has to be, dad's a muggle, mom's a witch, bit of a nasty shock for him when he found out. Of course, Molly Weasley. Ronald Weasley, how dare you steal that car when he gets a howler. Brilliant. We have um, Gryffindor and Slytherin, the scarves. I love those. Keep those ones at the front because I actually always do use those ones. We have a Gringotts mug and we have um, a Gryffindor mug. This one was from Caitlin and Bethany, my two number one fans who pushed me and pushed me and pushed me to do YouTube. Thank you, girls. I have a love potion one from the Half-Blood Prince. I also have slippers and a dressing gown to match that one as well. Okay, now we've got one from, like I said, Souvenirs, The Making of Harry Potter, Warner Brothers Studio Tour London, Marauder's Map on one side and the Footprints on the other side. Then we've got a Jurassic Park one from Truffle Shuffle. Jurassic Park is on par with Harry Potter for me, the whole series, Jurassic World, Jurassic Park, I'm obsessed. And then we've got the big one. So, don't know why I did that. The most recent time that I went to Harry Potter Studios was 
November last year, or maybe December actually, and when I got to the train station part, they had a huge railway mug, so I decided to get that. Wasn't cheap, but look at it, it's stunning. I love it. I'm just making sure I've not missed any. That is probably, it's the, it's the favorite cupboard. Don't tell that one though. I get so excited when I show people my mugs because I'm like, you know what, Lauren? This is a good collection. Okay, so we're moving on to the smaller cupboard, which is just as cool, okay? Just as cool. Uh, hi, everyone. How you doing? Hey, Olaf, how you doing? Look at him. He's so cute. That one's from Primark. I actually got two of these. Yeah, that's the, that's the other one. I've got two Nemos and two Olafs. The shelf, I've got loads of up mugs. We have this one. I don't know if you can see. It's got like all collage on. It's got Carl and LA, Grape Soda, Paradise Falls. I've also got another one of these, Seriously Wrong With You. I got about seven of them and I've given them all away, but I've still got two. But we have a Lion King one. More Harry Potter ones. I've got two of those ones as well. We've got Platform Nine and Three Quarters. Think you mean funny, do you? That one. Um, I've got two of these. Have you seen this wizard? When you heat these up, Sirius Black comes there. Cool. And then we've got a Diagon Alley one. The Leaky Cauldron, that's in London. Another up one. Adventures out there. <laughs> You're weird. I like you. Love, 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 love Pixar. Another up one. That is the Wilderness Explorers. <laughs> I told you I've got obsession with up. And then another Pixar one which has got like Ratatouille on, Up, Toy Story, Wally, and another Finding Nemo one, the same one as the other cupboard. I've got loads of mugs that I've got duplicates of. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming. <coughs> then we've got a Cinderella one. It's hard to wake up when you've been out past midnight. That is made for me. We've got a More Than Just a Princess, which is my business, Chick Flicks one with some bridesmaids coats on the back. Love bridesmaids, keep smiling, keep shining. Got an alien one. When you heat this up, OMG, I've got to show you this. I've got to heat this one up. Okay. Let's just put this back over here. No, quick! Look! <laughs> the claw. We are eternally grateful. It's really cool. Okay. Wow! The claw. Next, I have a Descendants one with my name on. Most of these now have been kind of like made for me. A best friend one with me and my friend. I've got a Drop Dead Fred one. Snot face. <laughs> if you've not seen Drop Dead Fred, I don't care how old you are. You gotta watch it. Pizza Planet. Whoa. Um, then we have one for me and my boyfriend, Little Miss Princess, that's me, and uh, Mr. Perfect. I don't know who decided to get him that one because he ain't Mr. Perfect. Another Harry Potter one. And then another business one, more than just a princess, but this one says Lockdown 2020. Disney, TV and movies, Descendants, Barbie, Chick Flicks, The Greatest Showman, Harry Potter, Toy Story, Mean Girls, Friends and Pop Music. How cute is that? And then I have my Christmas ones and they obviously still are on display because I love Christmas. It's my favorite time of year. And my last favorite one is this one. I'm sure this is one from Truffle Shuffle. It has a crown on it. And it says, 99% um, sure I am a Disney princess. And um, why do I keep winking? I sp speak fluent Disney. So <laughs> those are my mugs. Now, you might think my collection's really big. I don't think so. I think it's gotta be bigger. We're gonna need a bigger boat. I've got um, these four as well from the Wisdom Collection. <gasps> I'm gonna end up dropping these. Um, the bottom one is Jiminy Cricket, then Baloo the Bear, then Lumiere, then the Genie. 
And that is my mug collection. I hope you really enjoyed watching this video. I would love to know what your favorite mug is because I've showed you so many and they're really hard to choose from. Maybe choose a top five of your favorite mugs of mine. And maybe one day when I actually do display them properly, you'll be able to see it on YouTube. I'll do a YouTube video on how I put them all on display so none of them feel left out. I will be able to show you which ones I buy because I'm now addicted to mugs. Woohoo! Please make sure you subscribe to my channel because I do these videos um, for you guys and your support means the absolute world. I love you all so much and I can't wait to see your mug collections in the future. Bye bye for now. Mwah!